Fairchild, 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 Fairchild. Just in case you were wondering, today we're looking at a product made by AML that is inspired by Fairchild. It's the 627 Variable Equalizer, considerably less famous than its counterpart, the Fairchild 660 Valve Compressor or the Fairchild 670, and considerably less famous than the Pultec P1A, which you can find in hardware or software forms everywhere. It's also seriously unfamous because there weren't very many made. They were mainly partnered with the compressor in mastering houses in the States, very few in the UK, and were used at the vinyl cutting rooms making the final tonal alterations for vinyl record masters. Very similar layout you might have noticed to the Pultec P1A, but just because it's not as famous doesn't mean that it's not as good. My name's Keir Stewart and I'm a mix engineer, content producer, and as a background task at the studio, I test a lot of equipment for and on behalf of AML at various stages of development. And today we're going to have a quick listen at what the variable equalizer inspired by the Fairchild 627 is going to sound like. Now, if you're a software musician or a uh, analog studio enthusiast, if you're interested in having a little bit of real valve tone in your signal path, then I would seriously consider getting hold of one of these kits, bearing in mind that a genuine Fairchild 660, which has been serviced, can fetch anything between £11,000 and £22,000. Then considering that the variable equaliser kit is coming in at way less than £1,000 and can be put together in just a few hours, it's a bit of a no-brainer. So without further ado, here are some audio examples which demonstrate the tonal properties of this fantastic equaliser.
Given too much for me to show And please don't try To make it easy on yourself Cause I know I know how you feel And all through this time I tried to see sense through Yeah. Uh-huh.
ਮੇਰਾ ਦਿਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਮੇਰਾ ਦਿਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਤੇਰੇ ਬਿਨਾ ਤੇਰੇ ਬਿਨਾ ਦਿਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਮੇਰਾ ਦਿਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਤੂੰ ਹੀ
how do you read me? Hello, how do you read me? Do you read me how? Affirmative, Dave. I read you. Open the pod bay doors, Hal. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. What's the problem? I think you know what the problem is just as well as I do. What are you talking about, Hal? This mission is too important for me to allow you to jeopardize it. I don't know what you're talking about, Hal. I know that you and Frank were planning to disconnect me. And I'm afraid that's something I cannot allow to happen.